There you go, guys. Thank you so much for the support. And we are starting. But now we see how the Viper pick oh, something yeah. that you don't expect to see. Mongols. Mongols in hideout versus Bohemians. This I'm going to tell you something. This is a good way to lose maybe a match. You know? Yeah, man. Uh, let's see. Because... Oh, yeah. Oh, you broke the alert. Aye, aye, aye. You broke the alert, Mr. Grumpy Group. Thank you, man. Thank you so much. I see some... Some brutal... Oh, Donjon. Donjon also got a gift. Hidden Gamer. And some people... Which kin... People that have been subscribing the channel a lot. Thank you so much. Oh, I'm gonna yeah. mute the alert now for a moment. Because it's gonna be... Appearing the the, the the sub alert for 23 times. All right. Uh, I don't like the Mongols here. I think if they can go for the late game, Bohemians is so dangerous. But Viper, and I'm uh, he will never admit this. But do you think, guys, in a map like this, he will pick this civilization if he playing against some other names? Don't think so. You know? Don't think so. I think Mongols is just. A very strong seed, but this is slow. Bohemians, poof. obviously, if you play perfect, uh, Magundais, Rams, you know. So let's see. But in theory, you prefer Bohemians in a map like this, you know? Yeah. But well, it's true that if, if it's not in this situation when you are going to pick those seeds, right? If you feel favorite, you have to pick it, but maybe, maybe it's gonna go feudal aggression, you know? Who knows? I don't think so, but let's see. Let's really see. Okay, those are the overlays, and uh, sadly, well, there is all the alerts that it's gonna be difficult. Let me just a moment. I will just remove the alert just during the overlay so you can see the Mongos overlay. And Mongos just have the hand bonus. They can go up very quick. And let's see what the Viper is going to do. The snake in this one. All right. Okay. Okay. I think the yeah. Okay, the super gift broke the alerts, man. But broke it completely, man. Unbelievable. Anyway. So I have time at the gift in a break. It's fine. It's okay. Ah, no. Okay, we have six fellas on wood. And he's up 19 population. But what is he going to do? He's gonna go feudal boom. Yeah, he's not gonna go forward or anything. Okay. Feudal boom into what? He's exploring through the farther area. And now he should attack the scout. Ah, oh, man. Yeah, because you're going to kill it. You're gonna kill that scout. Yeah, that the scout is bye bye. Dolu Itan scores collar. It's very important, guys. This is really, really, really important, you know. Really important. Yeah, man. Grumpy Grump, thank you so much, man. Really. 23 subscribers give this insane, man. 
But can you tell me one thing? Why 23? Why not 20 or 25 or 22? Are you 23 years old? I can see a step lances and siege push. Well, I think he should do some aggression. This is still not mining any gold. Fast field by Viper. Well, he's just doing double attacks and horse collar. That gives you a little bit better economy in long run, you know, than if you make all these farms. Now he's doing the barrack. He's mining the gold now. He has no loom. And uh, he's gonna do market and blasmid. He doesn't have a barrack yet, so I hope he's not gonna do market and blasmid. He should do barrack and a stable, you know. In my opinion, you need to have map control. He's doing the stable, so with Bohemians, he's just gonna play like arena. He's doing the barrack. I like it. Yes, he's good. But he has only one village on goal. I mean, he's gonna be slower up than his opponent. That's for sure. But he's gonna be market on a stable, probably. Okay. Yeah, but Sobek is gonna be up, up much quicker. Okay. Okay. Stable. A market. Well, you are going to be slower than your opponent. He can't see the... No, he cannot, even if you got more LOS with this. And he's gonna go up now. I mean, you gotta have a small economy advantage. But that's it. He's gonna be a slower up. And he's just gonna play standard. With his tables. Let's see. He's four villages ahead. Viper zero second title. This is Sovex seven seconds. And doing a scouts. Remember that they don't have bloodlines. Bohemians. Okay. Be on goal and play completely, completely standard. What advantage has Bohemians now? Well, they have gold mining average for free and gold south mining, you know? So they collect the gold strong, really fast. Okay, there is another scout and. Just get in and you kill. Yes. Now when he's doing a monastery, that's fine. Or make this a scout out a scout. Why not? He's the initial scout, just go and explore everything. He's doing the monastery. And they are playing basically like arena. This is one of the approaches that are, let's say, the most boring. But let's be honest, we love the Viper. But he's a boomer, you know? I mean, he's kind of... Weird to see him going really forward or something. He did, you know, and there was a game that he went forward. I don't know, it was in this map. I don't remember against who and in what tournament. Because I cast a lot, but I remember that I was surprised positively because he went forward and was very nice aggression. It helped him a lot and won the game. But in general, he's, he loves to boom, you know. Doing an extra on center on the left. And now, that is scout. No, no, no. He took it. Good micro. Pozo and light gap. KD 2-0 right now. Well, and that's the thing. Both are going to have the second on center. But it looks like now the food income for the Viper is just better. He's doing the third TC. He has... 11 farms, now he's doing 9 farms, but a little bit better economy. More farmers. I mean, when you are slower up, you usually get a little bit better echo. 
Obviously, if your opponent, uh oh, this is light caps. No, no, no. Let's see the micro. He got a spear, and Bohemian's spears are solid. Casman even. Wow, he's committed. He's really committed. Okay. I mean, now that's the problem. He did husbandry. He's gonna get some up control, but uh, he might have idle TC from now, Viper. He didn't yet. 17 say, yeah, you see? But now he's getting more. More idle time. Yeah, you cannot afford everything, you know? He's come. Oh, that's terrible, man. Really bad. And in mind that he's taking another monk. Well. Well, 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 he's doing the loom, which is not the greatest when you have 5 HP. 1, 2, oh my god. Well, that light cap is already a hero. He has killed 3 units. And well, killing two, monk, two monks is sick. It's really sick. And he's being annoying here. Well, he's one village ahead. Viper is still, oh my god, only 25 seconds idle TC, even with husbandry a light cat, his economy is really on point and he's playing his mood. Well, he's the boss of the macro, right? So when we're talking about Bohemians versus Mongols, we are always talking in an idealist scenario. You play perfect with both, uh, Kubnice is really hard. Bombard cannons, Kubnice, move it, yeah. Okay. He's being annoying. He's just being annoying with this. And now, he's gonna try to snipe, but he can't. Yeah, it's time to lose it. Oh, he's being annoying with that light cat. Okay. I mean, it's 2 HP. If you touch the villager, if you kill it. Uh oh. He's gonna now take it? No, he lost now. Lost it. Well, that light cat is already. The big damage. Now he bought it food and wood. Yes. And doing heavy blow. He's missing Will Barrow and he has already Viper two relics. And probably soon the third. Well, if you are with this Billy lead, uh, get all the relics to make a total domination. You know? It's gonna convert now the spear. Oh my god. Yeah, well, he now can kill it. And if you get some damage without the spear, you're gonna heal. No, oh, well, Viper is just, uh, just destroying him right now. Yep. He's now doing TC number four. Such a boomer, man. Aye, aye, aye. He's going now to take another monk. You got that big kid in me. Yeah, he's gonna kill it. Kill it. Now kill that spear. And, uh, well. Brutality, guys. Check the KD, guys. Check the KD. 10-1. You know? 10-1. Sick. Well, it's still the same village number. You know, 29 farmers, 3 villages behind only. So, Bohemians are still dangerous, you know? Obviously, you are not getting map control. The Viper has... Light caps, you don't have anything. One is called one is spear. So let's see if Viper is gonna come forward. Will Barrow now? We'll see. Uh-oh. No, no, no. Oh, he's taking the relic, man. Ay ay ay! All the relics! He took the relic from the from the left. You kidding me, right? Yeah. Well, he has all the damn relics. Well, he picked a civilization that you don't see often, but Viper is playing full focus, you know? 100% focus, as you can see. He has 5 on goal, and with 5 on goal, he has 800 gold right now. He's gonna make hand card as soon as he can. And well, castle forward or not? Still, Bohemians is dangerous because if you go up, you can make chemistry, so you do bomber cannons right away. But it's scary, man. It's scary. And now, wall in. Gate. Stone gate. I like it. I like it. Is just gonna make the castle here? I mean, yeah, I will do the castle here. You don't need to go more forward. Just here, castle. 
That's the spear. Universities used to go up. Careful, don't lose the spears. Yeah, just convert another and you're fine. Nah, he's gonna make it home, the castle. Yeah, he's playing super safe. Super safe. Sobek is about to go up, but Viper is going up quicker. He's up to Imperial Age, guys. With five LAs more. And with five relics more. Okay, he deleted all the walls. Ay, 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 you think he's confident? Well, he knows that he's ca he cannot get raided. Yeah. Sobek is about to go up to Imperial. It's only four villages different, has four tone centers, but... Uh-oh, there's a scout. And that villager is without the loom, might kill a villager. No, he will save it, Viper, let's see. If he save that villager... Casco. And his wall, he is disgusting. It, it, I, I hate him. I mean, I, I hate him. I, I, I hate him. He, he asked, seriously, man. I mean, and he walled, you know? It is disgusting, you know? Not only save the village, but also wall, you know? It, it, it's... Ugh! Come on, man! Seriously, man! Ay, ay, ay! Anyway! He's doing all the time, man! All, all the time! My goodness! Alright! Now he's walling here. He's gonna go with the pikes and archery ranges. The Viper is doing what? Mango dice? What is he doing? <laughs> I left the scout outside, exactly. All the task. Okay, gonna kill them all. Got it. Well, those pikes are very powerful, remember? Really powerful. And now Viper is gonna do. What is he gonna do? He's gonna do Lancers? Population, guys, after all this, is the same, you know? It's literally the same. He's doing the loom, and he's going to do what? Onagers! Okay. He's going to go Siege. He's going to go Siege because he's gonna cut. He's gonna go drill, gonna cut, and gonna kill the economy. Oh my god! Be respectful! He's gonna cut and he's gonna kill the economy with donors, man! Ay, ay, ay! He's seriously disrespectful, man! No, he's not even doing or uh, hazard. Well, not for now. Doing more siege workshop, okay. He's gonna cut and kill Echo. He has to be careful if he's coming with cannons. Cannons are coming. He's now doing the outpost. Yeah. But the Onager is gonna be there in a moment. And he will cut, man. Light cap. He need to cut fast and unpredictable. Look at this guy. Okay. He's cutting already, man. Maybe 30. Yeah. And now, economy in the damn hell. 1,000 score difference, he could here, ignore the face-to-face. -face. He has to come, and now he's gonna come to defend. The lighters are coming, I'm gonna try to kill the Echo. Okay, he's doing a castle here. Obviously, if you do bomber cannons and halves, then you need to be careful, go back, don't lose the Onager. He won't, look at the castle on the left, and light gets here. Doing the fletching, killing Billy's. And he's having fun. He's killing villains now, not many. Well, the three pieces, the castle is perfect. It's really good to defend all these stone centers. You know? I mean, Viper still does have a lot of farming, actually. Sobe has more, but his economy, it is at the limit. He's gonna kill the, the Bomber Cannon because now the multitasking is crucial. And this is why now the Bomber Cannon is just down. Yeah, and that's very expensive. He's doing hoardings, he's going with the light caps, doing another castle here, and now he's going with the traps. Okay. Trying to kill the bombers? No, no, no. You can. You got the hand cannon here. But he's just creating chaos. He's still solving with more population. Put and go crazy. He's gonna make siege on this. 
Siege on us? Guys, with the speed those owners have, he can't catch up the army, man. It's crazy, man. Really? Okay. Doing more traps. He has no resources in lead magnetized. There you go. He has no resources to make cognition because he's creating the chaos. Now, oh my god, Onagers. And, and, Bomber Cannons? No, didn't kill it. Okay. But man, with the Onagers, he's holding. Oh, he lost another. You got to be careful. Now he's microing. Sobbing with more army. You have to be careful. The score is still crazy, but let's see. Now I lead my guys. Missing a lot of upgrades, but they are, ooh, killing the monks. Okay. The score is still scary. Need to go back. I mean, the Magudais are missing a lot of upgrades. There, lead my guys plus one. Now, Botkin is still no good in oath for the snake. Because he's here now holding. And Sobek is gonna keep trying, you know? Like, 100%. Why not? His population is amazing, actually. Really good. But guys, remember, if he mass Mago dies, no, no. That's the pro. Oh my god. Yeah, it's. I mean, you need to have a crazy multitasking. He's gonna go skirmishes. So, skirmishes versus Onegers and Mago dies. I mean, he needs Cognition. He's just missing so many upgrades now he's doing. But he knows that if he holds and he's able to do the Cognition. Maybe he can do something. Still, check the resources and five relics. The bomber cannon is down. He's gonna do siege honors or not? I want to see siege honors, man. Well, these need to have thumbprint, part and tactics. Yeah. Well, the Magudais are now plus three. Doing the armor now. He's missing ballistic. I think he's missing chemistry too. Yeah, he's missing all the upgrades. And Viper resources are disgusting right now really disgusting and you can see how he can't really counter his opponent there's a trap he's coming with another trap and i wouldn't mind to see now six rams for example ferraris like i like to call them yeah man Ooh, okay okay you don't want to go closer and cannon you need to micro too uh oh he's gonna lose not anymore Uh, the Magon died. Oh, almost. But he's the only one threat. He's doing now Hazard, Parthen Tactics. The Magon dies are here. He's still far for 200 pop. Sobek 200, population 160 villages. But the problem for Sobek is that his army is just so weak. Look at the army he has, guys. He has one Bombard Cannon, one Trap, two skir uh, 12 skir uh, Pikes, and 23 Skirmishers. And now, Siege Onager. <coughs> Sorry, upgrade. See Chonagar. Upgrade. Elite Bagodice. Fully upgraded, only missing ballistic. Like he has everything, while his opponent has not even halves. Not good Nietzsche. Only two bomber cannons. Oh boy. And now, yeah, the Magodice killed the bomber cannons very fast. Really, really fast. Now he's gonna take that trap as also. Yeah, it's total domination, guys. It's just... It's just another level player, and... Uh, that's why I'm very surprised to see this map. To win this fight, you have to try something out of the box. And uh, if not, they just destroy you, guys. And this is exactly what the Viper is doing now. And Sobek is 200 population, yes, but guys, he has... 175 billion. He's definitely gonna have economy. But man, Kubnishin. Do Kubnishin now. Okay. Kubnishin, amigo. Well, he's not doing. Now he's doing Kubnishin. They are very strong, but he doesn't have Siege Engineer. And if your opponent has Elite Magudais, Siege Onagers, Kubnishin is a scary less. A little bit less. Now Chemistry is still no ballistic. Kill the Bomber Cannon. And, well, the spot is a little bit tricky here. Gonna make another castle, Kisul. Uh oh, gonna lose the Onager. He lost it, he didn't notice. Still no Siege Engineer. And remember, five relics for the snake. Yeah, 
Okay, he's putting wider. Make more space just to build more also. Yeah, look at the Magnetic how they eat the, the cannons so fast. Now doing the cab ramps. And well, he's doing he's gonna make all the techs. All the techs. The Halvard has got plus one now, but C Turner's a Magnetic is killing all. The KD is just growing and growing. Trebuchet killing the castle. Trying to kill the siege war shop. Just kill it. Ballistic finally. Okay. And definitely you need to micro properly. And this is exactly what the Viper is doing. Put in more map. And Kugnisha, guys. Kugnisha is already there. It's still no siege engineer, which is not the best. And he's gonna cut now. Yeah, cut and raid. Oh, baby. Well. Bam, bam, bam. Where is the skirmishers? Kill it them all with the sea chonners. Okay. Kill it them all. More threats are needed, probably. Population is still solid for Sobek, but he's inside now raiding and raiding. I like a lot how he's moving, but, well, now the Viper has the mobility. 4,000 score difference. GG has been called. The civilization matter, but the player matter matters even more. This this Viper man, he never let Sobek to to have a good army. If you think about it, he just got now the Hubnische, he got ten skins, twenty halves, and he never let his opponent. He never let his opponent to go aggressive. You know. Yeah. Okay, Viper won the game. Hera will have beaten Viper here. Viper wouldn't pick Mongols against Hera. Statistics, 143, 103, economy, 4,000. 4,000 resources more and 3K gold from the relics. You know, I was going to have a lot of gold from the relic. Domination by the snake. We keep going, guys. We keep going, and this is a very, very nice matchup. Because we have now Sobek with Incas, the Viper with Portugal, Portuguese. It's an interesting one because it's always hard to play against an eagle civilization. So, how is going to play here the Viper? That's the question. He's going to go extremely aggressive. Playing against the eagle thieves is always tricky. Always. Super tricky, you know? So, let's see what is going to be. I will give you some medins, amigos. Well, let's see. Because the map, I mean, they are more or less far. Is he gonna play aggressive? Playing aggressive against Incas is not easy, you know, because they they are like the second Byzantines, right? They can spam. They are cheaper unit now, so let's see. Who is my glasses? I need my glasses, guys. I'm tired. I'm GG. So. There's no trick with the Incas. Incas is very solid. You know? I believe that it's very important who is gonna reach Castle Age faster, you know? How are the New Orleans guys versus the Eagles? I don't think so, they are terrible. I think, if I'm not mistaken, the Organ guns now are used a lot worse against the Magonals, but not against the other units. You know? They have some they have some special bonus. Okay, he should wall that, that Valir. 
Because if not, the eagle can't take it. You see? Okay. In the last second, but wallet. And here. Oh! A Barracor, really. That's good advice. And it's good malicious. Interesting. Very interesting. He's gonna make more than two? No, he's doing two malicious. He's sending the malicious. And the vibrate is just walling a little bit. Already. Let's see what he's planned. For now, he is still producing villages. Oh! He's gonna go past castle? I mean, like seriously? Uh oh! No. Don't have the LOS in, in Feudal Age. In Dark Age, sorry. He's one in the berries. He will the wood line. And he smell well he has see the bar right. So he knows that he's coming. Ooh. He's gonna take the house. Yeah, that, that's why you don't want to make the house so far, right? So he's gonna take the house. The Viper keep doing villages. Yes, he is. He's doing now the Barrack. Okay. But... He's not doing the Barrack, actually. What? <laughs> He's gonna wall like crazy. Still not doing the Barrack. And he can't do anything there. He doesn't have the loom. Still doing villages, doing farmers. And what is this approach for the Viper? A greedy one. A really greedy one. Still the barrack not done. He's gonna make two more villages and loom. Okay. And well, he's trying fast castle. Now the barrack, I think it's a wall now. Oh, is he gonna take more houses? That's gonna be very annoying, actually. And he's up 27 population to feudal age. The question is, is it worth it to have two militias and one eagle to kill houses? Ooh. Okay, we will find out. And very soon, actually. He's doing the RT range. Is the Viper just gonna make stable and blacksmith? He's gonna go knights? It's still one minute, guys. One minute away. He took the house, and now he's gonna take another. Okay. I mean, he will need some, some archers to make the damage. The problem is that now he's open, and he can't really disturb his economy. In 30 seconds, he's gonna be up. He has four on goal. And... He's coming with the archer and the spear. Six villages on berries and it's still open. No panic, guys. No panic. It's only 12 minutes, but the Viper is gonna do what? RT range and blasphemy. Okay, no stable. But you need to do it quick because he's coming. Yeah, but he's one archer. And he will go up. All right. Now he's walling. He should now send a ability and palisade this. He failed. Let's see the micro. I'm not even checking. It's not gonna lose a value. I mean, he won't. He's gonna make some skirm. Yeah, and he's up to castle. He's casting. You know? No panic. No nothing. Took the houses. And now, trying to kill the eagle. This scout is coming. No, no, no. This Kimi says there already. No, no, no. 
If he just killed the archer with the skirm, he's fine. He's crazy. How sure he was going to be about this? This is experience. A lot of experience, you know? And confidence for sure. He's gonna kill the archer with the skirm. He has two already. So now he needs to go back. And now he's doing a stable. Okay. The Egan is bye bye. He can kill it. He didn't. And remember that the knights are cheaper. He's now doing fletching, double attacks. I think he will do wall here. You never know. But uh, eagle, it's down. Okay. How many skirms? Two and a third coming. Now I need to send it back. These arches are with fletching. Now he has to react more because with fletching, the arches are dangerous. More dangerous, but he's gonna drive him on the TC. Not gonna be housed anymore. Or scholar. And there's some villains that are already idle. Sobek is not too far from going up, but the timing, guys. The momentum is for the snake. He has a market. He's still. Well. The knights are coming, guys. And when the knight has come, guys, what happened, right? What happened, amigos? The pillars are gone. Ay, ay, ay. Well, the knight will... Will deal. He's doing a monastery. Don't lose the scout. Yeah, now with the skims, he can't kill the spear. The knight will, will take over. Absolutely will take over. Eh, well, well, well. Careful. The knights don't have a lot of upgrades. Well, don't have a lot of upgrades. Well, he has plus one. He's playing. No. He cleaned it already. And his opponent is going up. But now he's walling and doing a second barrack. Incas. Incas. Alright, he need to wall. But he's gonna make a TC. And he's just booming, guys. A standard boom into domination. We'll see. Remember that he can do a lot of eagles, but he's sending already the knights. If he break in, it's a disaster. It's a real disaster if he's really breaking in. He's sending one knight and he has not a single range unit. Okay. This is gonna be up. Two arches are coming. Trying to find a hole, but there's no holes. Still one minute to be up. You know, still one minute to be up. It's gonna take the relic. Like the goal is. It is very important. Remember that those Incas houses, well, 10 population, but he has 95, so all good. And now he's starting to mine stone to have a castle, guys. Right? No! He just moved them again. Okay. He's going to the middle to make a TC. He's gonna take the relic. And he's booming, man. He's playing against Incas, but he's booming. Double Barrack. He's gonna go full Eagles now. Like, if he's spamming Eagles, he has to be careful, man. He's doing a third turn sent, he's taking relics. But it's also true that if you have knights and, and monks, you should be fine. Obviously, his boom is gonna be just better. He has Bozo already. And three TCs, guys. Three stone centers. Quite fast. Oh. Or maybe not. Or maybe not. Oi, oi, oi. Doing the houses again. 70%. He got a seat. Not really. Let's see his reaction. Nah, he's gonna make it. Dig is out there. No, no. He's up. Just in time. Perfect. Okay. He's going around now. He should make a gate, maybe. A market. It works also. Okay. He has a monk. He's walling. He's not fully walled. And now he's going to convert an eagle. Like a hundred percent. Oh no. They have bonus like the scouts. He's gonna go away. Yes, he went. 
And there's now a siege war shot, but this is the thing. He's gonna try to go very aggressive. I like it. Seven eagles, but he has five knights, three monks. He's still mining a stone. And the problem that I see here is that Viper soon will try to do a castle here. I mean, this area, this area, whatever. But a castle, 12 on stone. 12 on stone. And he's five of ahead. He needs to, to avoid the castle, blue. He has to. But now, oh, a Thonaman, okay. Yeah, but he has three monks, okay. A Thonaman is very important. Really important at this point. I thought that with the gold extra he was having, he will buy some stone. Okay, need to send all the army. Send him more knights? Not really. But he has three relics, guys. Three relics already. I mean, the way he's playing right now, it's a little bit greedy, the Viper. You know, he's tricky because his opponent is still spamming more and more eagles. He's now doing another stable. Okay. So he's doing more army. No. Okay. But guys, he has almost the stone to drop a castle. Doing more stables. But four stables? He has no food to make a... To make knights? Okay. Now look at the castle he's doing, guys. A uh, organ gun castle. Oh, the monk. No. No, no, no. It's tricky. It is very tricky. And as I'm telling you, it's greedy. He need to make the castle for sure. Oh my god! This is exactly what cannot happen. The monks, the monks. You cannot lose the monks. You need to bring the Magor. I'll deny that castle. He has a good opportunity. And now that's probably cost him the game. Why? Well, because he has already bloodlines, light caps, he has four stables, he's doing the castle in the middle of the map, he has 12 villages more, and Portuguese is no joke. It's a good civilization. It's really good civilization. So now if you send some light cap, wow. Also in mind that he's breaking in. Yeah, he's doing more barracks, plus two. He's a wall here, by the way, but he's not doing. Okay, he can do redemption at some point. The castle is just protecting the TC. And? Okay. But the eagles, there's many eagles there. Fervor, just to be faster. No, 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 no. Oh, you, 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 you. But he's coming with more knights. There's no monks, actually. Also. Organ gun here killing the villager. Interesting, for sure. But population is not too far. The Sobek. Yeah, in Vilius it is, but yes, army, more army. 20 eagles plus two. 20 eagles plus two. Oh boy. Ooh, he's gonna lose the monks? No, he convert an eagle, he's gonna convert another. No! Okay. He converted a couple of eagles. Now he's gonna come with the knights. He's gonna try to kill the mangle. He's under the TC. I think this is a disaster for Sobek. It's a lot of knights now. The knights are cheaper. He's gonna take the mangle and total domination by the Viper. Destruction, guys. Just destruction. The, the, the chance here for Sobek was that he denied this castle. Once that castle is there, he has a huge economy leap. And you can see 20 villages more. He's also doing organ guns. He's still spamming eagles forever, you know? But now the eagles are not even that great because the knights are stronger. So if you go knights, light caps, some monks, you know, he can convert also the monks. He got, he got a tournament. It's so difficult. And now he's gonna come and drop a castle on his face, on his real face. Yeah, he's gonna kill the, the monk with the eagle. Yeah, and now, castle on his face is absolutely over yeah he has the same army numbers so just look Viper is playing now this perfect perfect guys yeah crazy too guys he has the middle he has the forward castle the eagles are plus two but the knight with few organ guns look at the kd check the kd no chances guys 4612.
GG. Well played. My goodness. My goodness. 2 0, guys. 2 0. Wow. I mean, it went fast castle naked, you know? He went directly to fast castle. That's, that's, that's really crazy. 46 12. Economy. Yeah. Just look at the economy and just look. He didn't 10 minute feudal, 12, but 15 minute castle age. And Sobek did 19, which is fine, you know, but 22 will is more. When he couldn't deny this, it was completely over. Game three, let's go. Guys, we keep going. Yes. And we have game number three Mali and Sobek, the Viper. Malai. There was some people asking the other day, isn't Malai great on El Dorado? You got the answer, man. Malai can be insanely good here, man. Really, really good in my opinion. You know? The uptime in a map like this, it, it, it's just brutal. So let's see what the Viper is going to do. I'm very surprised that, well, yeah, Viper in this kind of map is usually super smart. Super, super smart. So let's see. Okay. Like, we have seen many times Malai here. I mean, they might be okay, but I don't think they are super great, you know? I prefer Malai for sure, you know? Remember that the middle is so tricky. What I don't like with these maps is like, around 20 minutes you, you have no more goal, and then if you lose the middle control, that's it, you know? Fist traps under the TC. What? No, oh, man. Definitely not. I'm doing this the the damn bettings, guys. There you go. Okay. When we have the dog at the back for both players, he's gonna make it now the Viper. Actually no, Viper is playing diff Oh! He's trolling, guys. He's trolling, man. Oi, oi, oi. He's trolling, man. Well, he's gonna make feast traps here, guys. Feast traps here. Oi, oi, oi. Well, he's gonna walk completely. He's gonna have extra population and... Oh, man. Troll. You know, it can work. Of course it can work. Of course it can work. He lost a Billy. I'm happy, man. I'm very happy for Troller. I'm sorry, guys, but he lost a Billy, man. You know? <laughs> anyway, let's see. He lost already a Billy, but remember that uh, Malai give you extra population. He's taking the fish. And he will do fish traps, of course. So he's not gonna go, but then he will have also free fish. So I don't know how good is that, you know? Obviously he's just trolling, he's trying something different. So he's gonna have the resources. And we will see what is he planning to do. Remember that the fish traps are very expensive, guys. Very expensive. It's not like it's cheap, you know? But it lasts pretty much forever. Now he's gonna be thinking like, what is he doing? I don't find the dog. Then he's gonna probably walk completely because he's gonna think that he's coming malicious. He doesn't see the dog. He will wall panic all the map arena, you know? We'll see. Or maybe he's gonna do the barrack. Just because he's like, hey, it's not on water. I need to go land. 
Okay. Piper is now gonna make the loom and he got how many fishing ships? Four already under the TC. All right. <clears throat> I was clicking up. He's not being faster than Sobe because he has clicked very late. And what is he doing, guys? I'm Menstradamus or not? He thinks he's coming, so he's walling absolutely everything. You know, like Arena. Piper plays too much rage for his task, correct. He's now going through his room in all the maps, you know? Okay. <laughs> uh oh. In seven seconds, he will have this scout. But he lost some HP. And he's doing a second dog. Now he's doing the Barrack. The Obama. So he's actually going for the land and ignoring the water. Okay. He's gonna do more fish. Yeah. He's doing more. It's fish booming, guys. Fish, fish booming. I believe it. He will do a galley maybe under the TC. Why not? And soon now the RT range. Tone watch. He's doing a spear, man. Population is exactly the same for both. Oh my god, don't lose the scout, man. Oh, come on. Like, you only have to pay attention to that. Oh, man. Okay. Uh, ¿Cuál era? ¿Qué, ¿Cómo se llama el correo del cole? Bueno, ahora, lo, ahora la miro. Venga. Ok, my daughter needs me, guys. One second. I deal many things, guys. Many things. I don't know. Okay. Let me use C. Okay. He's gonna take this. He has to repair. And he's doing already fish traps. What the hell? Seven fishing ships. He has the dog here. And now the stable, but guys, look at Sobek's resources. He's not working this strategy for the Viper, right? The troll is, is costing him the, the game. Maybe. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see. He's up to Castle Age. And the Viper now need to walk completely. He has 11 fishing ships here with fish traps. His population is much higher than his opponent. But is this gonna work? He has 7 fishing ships. 12 fishing ships already. He's not walling completely. Mm, I don't know. I really don't know. Ooh. 
Collar. Yeah, but look at the Viper resources. It's getting there. I mean, this is just a, a little bit of a troll gameplay, but also makes that the game is extremely boring, you know? Like, He's gonna make now the light caps, but if you don't have a galley here now, he can kill the, the, the fish traps. And now blue might see the dog. It's, it's a big troll, man. Look at the population, man. Well, Viper can do now the the, the buildings. Just look at his base. Okay, the overchop. Well, he has the spears now. He needs to go up and. More spears. The spears remember that they have the plus one also, so they are solid. But now, he should have done a galley. He didn't. He's gonna lose maybe one. Okay. But he lost the light gaps. And yeah, not gonna take anything. TC in the middle of the map. But guys, the Viper is gonna go up and he will have the stone to drop directly a castle there. So he will go pikes and that's it. He has 18 billies more. He has 8 billies more and he has 15 fishing ships, guys. What the hell? Oh, Siege Workshop. I like it. But if I ever need to go up, he's going up now. He's clicking or not. He's on the way to Castle Age. And now he can see the Siege Workshop. He's coming with the knight. So, how he's going to defend? We will see. But he still have galleys here. Not many. So he has to be careful. Now he's gonna move. He's gonna do another dog. What? Help. Unbelievable. Population here still ahead. He's ignoring the middle. But now he will have the stone for a castle. He's gonna do more pikes. He's gonna he's gonna trap those. Sounds nice, probably. No, no, no. Oh, they are trapped already. They are trapped already. Okay. And in goal, and now he's moving. The wood, he needs to go, probably. Go this spot. But no. The question is where he's gonna make the castle, guys. He has the stone. The castle has to be in the middle. It's pretty clear what he's trying. And now. Lose two. He's gonna do Pike Van Abrid, Queen Squires, and Pike Van Abrid. Well, 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 unbelievable, man. He's gonna take this game. Played like this, he's gonna take this game. Crazy. Doing the monastery. You have the gold. Pikes. You gotta be careful. Don't lose the spears. Pike Van Abrid. And three spears only. He's gonna wall them or not. It's fine, man. It's fine. Those are plus two, guys. These spikes are plus two. Now, two monks. You convert the knights. If he converts a couple of knights. Uh oh. Another monk. And this one. Give it to go. How's an alambrican? Yeah. I mean, he has two knights, two monks, and one mangonel. That army is doing now a tournament. He's gonna delete that one. He deleted. It's really nothing. Population is getting closer. It's three TCs, but we know how important is the middle, you know. And if he clean this and draw the castle in the middle, and I think he should put the castle here, everything will change. Oh, he's doing redemption? Yeah, redemption as well. Okay. Full pikes and now redemption monks. It's coming, you have to be careful. Redemption on the way, but no sanity. You gotta be careful. Uh oh, the miners are coming. The fish is gonna go down now. Ooh, ooh, the monks. But, but, where's the pikes? He's gonna be able to do it. Sobek is killing now, fish. Ooh, baby. But, 
He's trying to convert the monks and the pikes are coming. Now he has to be careful. He's micro like a god now. The redemption is just there now. And if he convert, if he now convert and he's converting everything, population is gonna drop dramatically now, military wise. Mine gonna be down. The pike is gonna be bye bye. He need to, well, remake the fish. Okay, I mean, the troll it makes that the game is being a lot more interesting than the previous games. Population, Sobek is still ahead. But now the monks, the monks can convert everything. And he's doing a castle, but the castle is a disaster, man. Why is it a disaster? Because if now Viper convert and make a castle here, he take all the gold. Aye, aye, aye. Okay, we'll see. Well, see, he has no gold. Now he's going to convert. He's coming with... Does he have a barrack? But where's the pikes? He has one pike only. And look at the castle. He's doing exactly in the spot I suggested. But he's coming now with all the villains. That castle take all. But let's see if he's going to make it. Population is the same right now. We'll borrow sanity. Ooh, going to convert the mangrove. He has no... Okay, doing pike now? Yeah, he has a lot of food and wood. Need to do pikes. And he's coming with the villages. Blue. He has gebetos, but he has the monks, man. And he's not doing a single wall or something. The castle is perfect, man. The castle is brutal. But let's see. He's going to convert. He can convert now the siege. Yeah, he's going to convert. No, oh, he deleted. Yeah, man. I mean, which one is better castle? He can take gold now. If he's doing fletching and botkin and guys, the viper will go up to imperial age. Unbelievable, man. He do the castle and he's up to imperial. He might lose the fish, maybe. Okay. But he's up to imperial age. He to wall just z oh. The castle is doing okay. But let's see the monks. The monks is going to convert the Gebetos. Yeah, he's gonna go away with the fish. Yeah, he will, but now he's going to convert all the Gebetos. Let's see. Oh my god. The troll game is gonna work and now he's going to convert the villagers. Probably. I'm trying to convert the Gebetos too. Oh man, oh man. You cannot lose the monks now. Okay, two Gebetos. You need to go now to the TC. He's gonna lose those the Gebetos. You need to go back. The castle is there. He lose the. He deleted the dog, by the way. He lost now quite some here. Still is on the TC. But he's in the Imperial. And he has the middle. Yeah, and we'll go traps. Fletching. Okay, doing another dog. He's gonna go Thalassocracy and then. This is there. He's in Imperial, man. He might be thinking like, what the fuck? He might be thinking, how, man? How he's in, guys. But the Viper is in with 20 bullets behind. Doing another TC, okay. 37 farmers, Bozo. But he has no army. He needs to spam army. Kevetos is going to convert. He's going to convert. Oh, he has already harbor, man. They are already harbor. Okay, no TC. Such a troll, this Viper. Yeah, and now with the threat, we'll take the castle and we'll take the middle. And without the middle, in my opinion at least, he has 24 bullets more. Yes, Malay have, Cano Galleys have everything. Husbandry. But the middle is crucial, guys. He needs pikes, by the way. With the Viper. Viper has only monks and two traps. I'll do another mining camp. Castle will fall. And uh, Cloudline is forging. He's gonna do light caps. Okay. He's going to convert. Block printing. Bot in arrow. To convert the Gavetos, he will. Converted one. Converted two. Converted three. And now, kill them all. Aye, aye, aye. Okay. 
Castle is down. See to our shop here. Like if that matters. Okay, population Sobek is still really ahead. He's now gonna take the DC. And now Viper needs a second castle here. If he's doing a second castle, can dominate. He won't have no sentence soon. So he should repair. Or not. Doing a siege war shop, conscription, now Barrax is coming with more light gas. Uh oh. Uh oh, the castle. It's gonna wall, the light gas are coming. The traps. Need to defend the trap. No, no, no. Okay, you need to repair that trap, which is. But the Gavetos are there. And he's gonna repair the trap or not? He's trying. And he's going to repair. A tower! Towers, man! Ay, ay, ay! Towers! No towers, please! Towers against Trebuchet! No, please! No, please don't go! Please don't go! Anyway, he has now zero, zero bullets on goal. He lost the town center. The troll viper has no TC right now, but he's just sending pikes. He's gonna make a TC maybe in the middle of the map. I don't know. The Tread will take the, the towers. The score still say that he's ahead. But now he has pikes and more gavetos than his opponent. He has 107 population, Soviet 139. This is all his food. But now the harbor just killed the scorpions. Crazy. Okay. He's walling. And he's taking the middle. Now Vipers will make a TC probably here, but he has no wood right now. He's gonna raid now. Well, he's going with pikes, doing RT ranges. He has three on goal. Eh, we'll lose them all. Ballistic and skirmishers. But ballistic and skirmishers won't help. Ooh, he's coming with the pikes. Do you need to defend the fish? And he will defend our fish. Yes. Obviously, one trap will help. He's coming here and take the castle. But Viper still have no TC. Zero tone center. Now plus three. Plus three the damn castle. Well, might troll or not, but the game is fun, guys. The game is really fun. And now, the Viper is doing a castle to defend his fish. What the hell? Two trebuchets. Okay, coming to take that one. Just go through the gate. The castle is going to be there. And as you can see, having the middle with a tattoo center with no TC. And you still win the game, you know? Obviously, uh, right now, he doesn't know what to do, you know, those spikes are plus four, the light gas is still taking those, but he will do more fish at some point, and that castle will defend now, and the fish is gonna be fine, not all the fish, but still, how many, 21 fishing ships is still alive, no, 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 yeah, he's going to move, and the pikes are, remember, plus four, and now he's sending more pikes, yeah, well, Viper has the gold, has the stone, he has the fish, he's gonna take the castle. And it's about time. GG, man. Crazy. The Viper, man. What the hell? I mean, seriously. What was this, man? Aye, aye, aye. Well, creative the Viper in this one. This was enjoyable to watch, you know. Probably he's not happy, Sobek. He's not, didn't enjoy, you know, uh, but what the hell was this, you know? What the hell was this? Military 1366 economy, 5,000 resources more for Sobek, and he still lose the game. And lost a in Dark Age. Well, that doesn't matter, you know. Viper did 56 villages, 27 fishing ships. That's why he won the game, man. Crazy game. Crazy game. Hopefully you have enjoyed. Thumb up, subscribe, leave a comment to you. But Viper is as living in the other series in another level.